Hi guys, Chris here from Azon Power Packs. I decided to do you a quick video. This is to, well, all about Action April. I know I keep going on about that, but I just thought it was quite a quite a good thing to do because April's a funny month when you um, when you sort of look at the year and all your goals in January. Um, everyone, most people, start out with New Year's resolutions and online. I mean, starting an online business or meeting your goals if you didn't do what you wanted to in 2013 and to be honest most people if they admit that, you know are, are honest they're going to admit they can improve on any part of their business so you get the new year and people set new year's resolutions building businesses and april's a funny month because it's sort of you don't know where if you're anything like me you don't know where the year's gone it gets to april and you're thinking wow it just seems like two minutes ago it was january and not the years running out, we've still got plenty of it. But that's why I decided to sort of theme this month and all of the videos towards action. Um, now I know it's not as simple as saying um, that you're not taking action. As I've said countless times, I know it's not that simple. I know that it is a case you take action, but you're not sure you're taking the right actions. So that's what all these, uh, this month and all these videos are about. They're themed towards you actually, or um, me helping you actually get off on the right foot and get a site up, get a few sites up, get 10 sites up, whatever it may be, because the long and short of it is really as simple as getting the sites up and out there. The only reason someone won't succeed with Amazon, uh, following the kickstart method for instance, is because they don't build the sites and again I understand how frustrating that is because you build one site and you want to see results from that so you get roped up in that and if you built one site in January you might still be working on it now as I say in April and the years going when in fact to start off with um, the best thing to do is to get up and running get the sites out there and keep going until you notice some sales coming in and then you can sort of analyze which sites are doing the best for you and then build up on the sites that are bringing the money in but anyway what I wanted to do that was a sort of like intro um, what I wanted to do in this video is one of the most asked questions I get from my clients and via email is how to write your Amazon pages or your Amazon content your reviews so I want to run through really quickly exactly how you can do that so you can see and a process that I use that you can't really go wrong. I'm going to quickly show you a product that's got a lot of information on it and would be very easy to write for. And then I'm going to show you a product that would be a little bit more difficult and what you can do if there's not a lot of information for the product. So very quickly, here we are. This is also a good one to jump on board. The Amazon Fire TV. It's a free, I think, I haven't actually looked. I suppose I should click on what is Fire TV, but I do know it's quite popular. And it's a tiny box, as it says here, you connect to your HDTV and it allows you to watch like Netflix and online services and YouTube, I think, um, through your TV. A bit like a um, free view Digibox, but the Amazon version. Now, to write a review on this, what you want to do, and this is talking about not the not when you've got a key phrase which is relevant key phrases. So for instance, if we were going to promote this product, obviously our site would consist of um, product reviews and also key phrases. So let's say a key phrase, for instance, was which is the best 1080p media player, something like that. That would be a key phrase and we won't deal with that here. I will do it in another video for you. But I'm going to talk about just the product review. So when you're writing a product review, the first thing you start off with is obviously the title. So you want to make the title engaging. Um, you can call it Amazon Fire TV. A closer look at the Amazon Fire TV, something like that. A review of the Amazon Fire TV. Amazon Fire TV, is this the best value for your money? Amazon Fire TV, is this the best 1080p media player? Something like that. Um, again, and you'll see throughout the course, you don't have to worry. I know I'm going against the grain a bit here, but you don't have to worry too much about SEO. What you have to worry about, and this is key, is that all of your information is quality at this point and unique. Um, so make sure the content's really good. So make a title that fits, but you don't have to have a title like Amazon Fire TV dash 
is the Amazon Fire TV the ultimate in a, in a, a media player, a 1080p media player. You don't have to keep mentioning Amazon Fire TV. So you just get the title there. Then the quickest way is the next thing you need is a introduction. And the quickest way to write your reviews is an old teaching um, saying, and it goes, you tell them what you were going to tell them, then you tell them, and then you tell them what you've told them, which sounds like a tongue twister, but really it's just as simple as that. So you start off with an intro, and your intro will consist of, in this, on this page, we are looking at the Amazon Fire TV, and it's got it here for you. So you don't copy this, but I'll just highlight it so you can see the bit I'm looking at. So you'd go, welcome to my review of the Amazon Fire TV. Um, the Amazon Fire, or, or welcome to my review of the Amazon Fi Fire TV. This is a tiny box that you can connect to your HD TV and it will allow you to watch online services. Um, a lot of the, and you, you full stop then, and then you tell them a bit about the online services. So you'd say, the days of renting video cassettes have gone, renting movies from your, your local store or renting them from Blockbuster, things like that, have gone. Um, and most of the services that you watch movies with are online. The problem with this is that they have to be streamed. And unless you've got an internet-ready TV, that means that you will need to either have a games console, which offers you the same feature, and if you haven't got a games console, it can be difficult, well, or almost impossible, to get the picture on your TV. As the charges of these services are normally around $20 a month, you want to make sure that any movie you're watching, you're able to watch in the comfort of your own home. This is where the Amazon Fire TV comes in. So I know I've gone on a bit there, but you can see how quickly you can write content, or I, I know I was speaking it, but you can get content organised, and you just introduce it. So that would be a good introduction. And then you'd move on to, you can use the features from here. So I'd say straight after that, let's have a quick look at the features of the Amazon Fire TV. So you grab that, and you can copy those features. Again, don't worry about duplicate content because you are just introducing the features. You're not, you're not copying. I'll just go down a bit. You're not copying all of this stuff. If you do that, your site probably won't rank. It might do, but it will just be pure duplicate content. What you're doing, it's not so much, and I, I, I say this, obviously I'm teaching my way what's worked for me. Um, what I have found, and again, unless you work for Google, take everyone, even myself, take it all with a pinch of salt, because no one can say exactly how the search engines work unless they work for Google. That's, that's common sense. But what I've found is the main thing isn't worrying about duplicate content. It's being worried about whether your site offers value. And you can say, look at the, um, let's have a quick look at the features. And what you do is you, you put the features down, and then what you want to do is look at the, you've got the features and you want to look at the benefits of each feature. So I could even write the entire review just using these. Because what I'd do is, I'd, let's have a look at the features, I'd paste that in and then underneath I'd say um, the Amazon Fire TV is a very good choice because the first thing it does is give you a huge range of movies, songs, and lots of games that you can pl play. In fact, it boasts a library of over 200,000 TV episodes, so you will never be stuck for something to watch. And all that's doing is taking that feature and mentioning the benefits. And then the benefits, again, perfect with Prime. So it says, unlimited access to thousands of popular movies and TV shows, um, like Downton Abbey and Under the Dome, um, with Prime, so you know that would be hard to mention because that's an Amazon service Prime, I'm not sure what it does. Voice search that actually works, here we go. Simply say the name of what you want to watch and start enjoying in seconds. Now the benefits of that, so that's a feature, but the benefits is I'd mention in the review. Um, another thing that the Amazon Fire TV does is include a voice recogni uh, recognition system that allows you to search for the movie that you want to watch or TV program 
without even having to leave the sofa. The benefit is not having to get up off the sofa and not having to use a remote control or find a remote control. So I hope one of the most valuable things you can get abstractly from the entire course um, with internet marketing is learning how to look at benefits and uh, sorry, ha look at features and get the benefits out of them. So if you can do that, if you can have a look at features and you can talk about the um, talk about the benefits, that's how you can expand on a review. And then tiny box and huge specs. Now tiny box, the benefits of that would be that it could fit anywhere. Um, if you're worried about space and clutter, the Amazon Fi Fire TV is all contained within a tire bo uh, tiny box that fits underneath your TV or you can put it on the side and it also has um, huge power. It's got a fast quad-core processor, 2 gigs of memory, a dedicated GPU and you will also get really good quality with a 1080p HD video and Dolby Digital Surround. So you see, again, if I was writing this all down, you can see how big or, or how long the, the review would be. And then you've got all this stuff. So when you're looking, and admittedly, this has got a lot of information on it. Once you've got the benefits of the features, you move on to the pros and cons. So you just want to quickly, you could either do it like a list. You could say pros, cons. Um, or, or you could rewrite more like this and make it really... Um, make your the more content you got get on there and the more quality it is the better you will do but you'd, you'd use this as a sort of um, you'd rewrite this again you wouldn't copy it because you're not going to rank but you'd rewrite it um, you know to make your make your review really appealing and then once you've got the pros and cons this, this is the main thing that you can add value would go down and admittedly I don't own one of these but what you want to do is you want to you want to look at the reviews, and I always look at the ones on the left for this because they always, it's like the most helpful, so they tend to be, I mean, you can read more here, and that will be a big review. Um, but you want to look at the, um, you want to look at what they're saying, and you can add that to your review. So you put a little subhead, and you put customer, customer opinion, and you put, looking at the reviews of this product, most people we're comparing it to Apple TV, so you can see this guy is. Um, and it takes a lot as well as it's slow. So this guy is saying Apple TV has got a lot of um, features and it's slow. The reason for selecting Apple TV is if you have Apple other Apple products. So you could mention that. You could say customer opinion. Most people were, com were comparing this product with the Apple TV. However, what you will find is that this product is refreshing new and it does pretty much the same as what an Apple TV would do and is perfect for you if you don't need to use it with other Apple products. So you can form the sort of opinion from customer reviews and there's so many to look for it. And that's how you write a review really quickly with quality content. Um, and then you put verdict or opinion at the end and you just put a massive call to action. Uh, we recommend the Amazon Fire TV. It's packed with features and you can pick one up for just $99 and watch all your favourite movies and all, all your services online in 1080p HD quality. Grab it now before the price goes up. These are selling really fast. And you might mention that more. You might say, in fact, looking at the customers, um, you can see how quick it's selling. 35 seconds, 45 seconds, 10 minutes. So make sure you grab one before the price goes up. So that's how you'd write a review. Now, just really quickly, because I know that took a bit of time, but that's how you write a review. You might want to watch the video a few times. Um, if I move on to this one, so this is just another random product. It's actually a car um, stereo, and it hasn't got a lot of information on it. So if I was going to write about this one, what I would do is you can see here, product details. It doesn't say anything. It says technical details, CD player, and product description, Pioneer double double din bluetooth so not a lot there all you have to do is look at the questions and answers if they're there um, again look at the uh, the features so this one's just got two features it's not got a lot so what we do is we'd look at that and we'd look at the reviews so you can see here I ordered this head unit two days ago on a 10 hour road trip 
and you take these, I mean this is also selling okay, and you take these here. Now I'm not saying copy the review, I'm saying, and it's got to read more so you could get more, and he goes, um, or she, he or she goes on about all the aspects of this, so BT phone, and it's even got the pros and cons for you. So all you have to do is rewrite this, or write it in a way in your own words, using this as a base to form the content, and you can write for products that even don't have a lot of information on it. And the key is just offering as much value as you can, and what I mean by that is by really really focusing hard on making sure that you're offering quality and that is how you stand out. Most people when they do their Amazon reviews will just um, sort of copy and paste stuff or write half-heartedly because they're just trying to get traffic um, but what you can do and the way you'll stand out is by focusing on quality. I hope you enjoyed that guys. Obviously if you've got any questions send me an email to support at azonpowerpacks.com and I also wanted to talk to you about um, you've got a link in your email. Uh, the Azon Power Packs, um, uh, the the Azon Power Packs Warrior Special Offer I released, the gaming headset one. You'll have a link there, but the link will go through to the membership offer. And the reason I'm including that is because for some reason, what I did was you've got the gaming headset one, and then you can optionally sign up for a membership, so you get the packs delivered every month. But for some reason, the the membership offer wasn't triggering. So you'd buy the first you'd buy the first headset um, package, and then you're meant to see the membership offer. And I think it's the setup with the payment processor it's using. It's not working correctly. I don't know why. Um, it's all set up correctly. I haven't set it up any differently to my other offers. I think it's because it is a uh, a monthly membership so it's no problem what I've done is for the inconvenience because a lot of you have sort of emailed me and said you want the monthly membership I have um, I, I've put the link in the email so you can click on that and go straight through to the page and for the inconvenience you will also get an extra PLR pack so you've got the gaming headset one but when you sign up for the membership through the link in your email you will also get um, an extra PLR pack for this month. That's not that's not adding to your um, subscription or it's not adding to the months. It's free. Uh, it's free for the inconvenience because you didn't see the page. If you've already got the monthly membership, because I know people obviously have been in contact, you will be able to download the free PLR pack. Um, it will be in the members area for you. So I just thought I'd do that and add that. And I'm I'm sorry for the inconvenience. And before you go. I just wanted to talk about there are coaching spots open. I've just sort of I will send a more in-depth video out about this because obviously this video was telling you how to how to write reviews really quickly. Um, but there are for those of you that are still watching, there are um, there's a link in your email as well. There are spots open. I won't make it really long because this video has gone on along, and in fact there's actually information in your email if you click on the link the way it works is this action April um, again everything's focused on action to get results so what I've done is devised three different plans for you now the plans will include a coaching option or a coaching option with the sites built for you and the long and short of it is there's three different plans bronze silver and gold bronze if you you know, you've, you want to get up and running, you want a base to work from, and you want to get a really quick intro into how all this works. And in fact, like what I've just done telling you how to write the review, it will allow me to work with you personally so you get this all, all down. All you need is a pen and paper for, for all three of these packages, and we will meet up and I will make sure that you understand. And the main thing is what you get from here is you get an action plan so you get an action plan the first one I mean again you've got the link in the email so you can watch these videos there's a video above each one bronze silver and gold bronze is for beginners bronze or not beginners but for people that just want one site as a base and coaching on how to do it or the site built for them and then you've got the silver package which goes up onto more sites and then you've got the gold which is for those of you that want to get earning as quickly as possible and you've got a few options there but do check out this page watch the um, watch the videos it explains it all 
and uh, book your spots. There's, I can't offer that many spots for this. There's five spots available um, for each package, but there are some spots gone. Um, you know, I, I simply lock it off once I get enough clients because obviously it's my time. And as you can see here, you've got two times 30 minutes uh, coaching sessions with me. Now, that's just with the bronze package, so I can obviously only have so many clients on board. So do check that page out. Make this action April. Make it when you actually, you know, actually get started and start getting the sites out there, and you'll start seeing results. It's as simple as that. When you start looking, and I, I know I've gone on and on, but when you start looking at, I can't make any money online, I don't know how to make money online, normally, in my experience, this is 10 plus years, and again, just my experience, it's because people aren't focusing on one thing. They're jumping from one product to another. They haven't got a system that works and they're just hoping that something will come along. That, and uh, admittedly, this might be a bit of um, marketer's fault and so on, making the product seem like the next, the best thing since sliced bread, bread. But the key is actually having a system. You will have to work at it. But my aims with these coaching plans are to get you up and running, off the ground, and making money as quickly as possible. And giving you a tremendous base where you can work from and you understand this stuff, you understand how it works. So I leave the video there, guys. I hope you've enjoyed it. I will see some of you in the coaching. And apologies about the, the power packs. The membership is open. You've got that extra pack there. And if you haven't got the membership, do grab that and you'll get the extra pack as well. Okay guys, cheers.